something. There she is! Hmm. Very impressive. I'm sure you'll accomplish great things for us. <clears throat> well, that's it then. Working hours are around the clock. You may keep that gravity glove. It's now assigned to you. Wear your own clothes to keep a low profile while in public. Oh, let's see, I don't think I'm forgetting anything. Heavens. Heavens, would you look at the time? It seems that we finished your exam earlier than scheduled. Oh, that's not good. Uh, maybe you would like to uh, enter the test chamber again? Hmm? No. Well then, no helping it. Off you go, I suppose. Now take the elevator to exit the testing area. I'm quite sure we'll see each other again soon enough. Now have a good day, Traversa. watching you. Why? Because we care. We are all the same. We are all cogs in the machine that is life. And to ensure that all cogs are functional, we are watching you.
Oh, Valerie, I came as soon as I heard. Your poor house. What's happened? Where is your father? Damn those rebels! Targeting a Raven Corporation employee in his own home like this? Such cowardice. No time to talk. I shall do everything in my power to locate your father and bring him back. We will get to the bottom of this. Sit tight and don't go too far. I'll need to speak with you again soon, but I have urgent business to attend. Don't touch anything. Just stay put. Good girl. I don't want to surround myself with the lower city peasants. They smell and cough too much. I don't want to get sick. Please remain calm. Raven guards have been dispatched to your location. Valerie, what are you doing here? Where's your... Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 don't tell me. They finally came for him, didn't they? Oh, that's bad. This is really, really bad. What are we supposed to do now? Val, listen. I made a promise to Linus that if something were to... to happen to him, I would tell you the truth. Remember a couple of weeks ago, when your father went away on a business trip? That was a lie. Linus was called to Raven Corporation to work on their new communication device, some new signal processing technique that they've developed. The Lower City Rebellion has been trying to get their hands on this technology from the moment they learned of it. And now, your father is gone. The Rebellion isn't foolish enough to kidnap Linus. He's one of Raven Corporation's greatest assets. Kidnapping him would bring the full weight of Raven's security forces down on top of them. There's more at play here than might seem. I can't leave Upper City. People are depending on me for their oxygen, but I have a friend named Jacob Fisher in the Lower City. He's head of Raven Corporation's surveillance team. He'll be able to help you, but he keeps the location a secret, even from me. If you can get his location, an oxygen mask and some sort of light source, I'll help you get to Lower City to meet with Fisher. Go find Fester, Cage and Gus, old friends of mine. They live in this part of town and you can get what you'll need. But you'll probably have to do something for them in return. Ooh, one more thing. Your father mentioned some strange radio waves he caught when he worked on the communication device. He said it sounded like our trace bots, but less robotic. I'm not even sure what it was all about, but it almost certainly related to his disappearance. Good luck, Val. I'll be here waiting for you. Found somewhere? Wait! Now I remember! Valerie! Valerie Bennett! Oh, I haven't seen you in years, but, but I've known your father for quite some time. You have your father's eyes, you know? That deep green always reminded me of the old stories about meadows and pastures from the surface. What are you doing in this part of town, eh? Phil sent you, didn't he? Mm, 
fat old so-and-so promised to paint my house and clean the yard weeks ago. I won't lift a finger before it's done. I tell you what. I bet Phil told you about Jacob Fisher, huh? I just so happen to know where he is. I'll tell you how to fight him if you'll clear my yard and paint my house. Should be over in a minute with that fancy gravity glove of yours. Uh, uh, start with the trash. Uh, just toss it right over the edge. Uh, 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 chuck it into the street for all I care. Then use these buckets next to me to paint the house. I'd prefer if you put red on the top, blue in the middle, and green on the bottom. Hoping to capture a bit of the colors you used to see up on the surface. When you're done, come talk to me and we'll see how you've done. I don't care much for Raven Corporation. Sure, they've kept us alive down here, but that doesn't make them trustworthy. You are the pillars of this community. Keep working. So wild and free. Uh, thank you, young Valerie. I thought I was going to live in this ugly mess till pigs could fly. <coughs> uh, don't bother asking what a pig is. Or flying, for that matter. I it's an old expression. Now, for my part of the agreement. There's a warehouse down in Lower City at Quakingstone Point. Uh, Fisher works there. Don't worry about how to get inside. You'll know how once you're there. For everyone, well. 